Hi friends, welcome back to another Dollar Tree shop with me. We've been covering so much here, but my stores keep getting new items. So, I mean, I'm not complaining. I love it. I'm also including more Christmas 2023 sneak peek photos at the end. Okay, look at this display, Gather Together. They have a whole bunch of different things. They have pot holders and matching oven mitts they have chargers these are so nice they have these right here it looks you know very high end must i say they have matching bowls and they do have these tumblers they are glass they also have the drying mats and these trays over here simply blessed Wow, I was so happy to see these and I wish I had found them before doing my fall coffee bar decorate with me video. They have the clear and they have it in this beautiful orange. They only had two left. I definitely grabbed both. These are glass guys. I couldn't believe it. They also have lots of tea light holders. They are leaves in different colors. Here's the dark brown. These are glass. Worker had just put a box of some harvest tea lights, those right there. I will cover them in my next video because she was fixing the display and I didn't want to interrupt her. I found them. I got one of each of those pumpkins with the haunted house. They were on my wish list. Lots of different tea light holders over here. We did cover them in my last video. Look at the mason jar signs, ghastly ghosts and goals. I found them guys they also have this one these are glittery uh, it says genuine graveyard bone broth here's this one with the different eyes all seeing eerie eyes these are very fun and very kid friendly here is this one it does have pink magic crystal shards very fun finds up here they do have the tractors once again hello fall those are still very nice they have these mushrooms they also have these with the leaf charms those are glass and look what i see the candles they have the jack-o-lanterns the black and white stripes and the candy corn ones which i wanted to see there was a lady right next to me, so I'm, you know, filming to the side because I don't want to be rude. Look at these chair covers, the jack-o'-lanterns, the skeletons. Look at these bags over here. We haven't seen these with the dangling legs, the jack-o'-lantern, the cute black cat, and the mummy. If I skip over anything, it's because we covered it already. I will link my Dollar Tree Shop With Me playlist so you can binge watch it and catch up on any other finds. Check out those previous videos, guys, because there's lots of great stuff. And there's also more of the Christmas sneak peeks that I will not be sharing in this video. So, you know, I don't want you guys to miss out. Go check those out. Look at these. How pretty. These are ceramic. This color. It's a very interesting color. It's not blue, it's not green, but it's very pretty. They have the perfect orange. They also have this mauve color. Wow, so nice. And they do have purple. We did see some pink purple pumpkins at Walmart, but also if you want to use this for halloween you can so there's the opening in the back for a tea light the bottles oh these but goodies if you're having some friends over and you guys want to watch some scary movies look at these buckets perfect for popcorn they're a really nice size they also added a bunch of these rose clips white black fuchsia and orange look at this display of all of their fall dinnerware so they do have matching towels they have oven mitts they do have salad plates some dinner plates they also have this collection with the leaves that we've seen over the years look at the cups and the mugs these are ceramic 
very pretty these are so nice you can you know display these also on your hutch these are not plastic by the way they also have some chargers some bowls in both designs and some drying mats you can make a nice gift also the glasses and then this print these were way up high in my last video the solar day of the dead skulls so it was nice to see them down here in this store they also got some new halloween faux leather look at the design psychic of salem fortune teller potions elixirs so i thought of possibly lining like a book or something or a diary i don't know a journal they have boo with lots of different words dia de los muertos they also have this design halloween boo the classic colors I had to put them down because they were in my way. This one just has different colored jack-o'-lanterns. Hmm, those were interesting. They also have these packets that come with two spiders. They have purple, orange, and black. They do have these that are tinsel, the jack-o'-lantern, which I thought was cute. They also have the ghost. Some decent sized skull heads. And then look at these new lawn stakes. Wow. I was so surprised because not only does it have, you know, the different design, the color, that's a spider. They also have a bat. And then they also have the chains. These are plastic, but, you know, they look pretty nice, to be honest. I did cover these signs in my last video, but I wanted to show them once again because I honestly think they're pretty nice, especially for those that love the vintage, um, the retro look. And then this store did have the black skulls because in my last store, they only had the green ones. So here's a look at the black one. Someone opened that. It wasn't me. Creepy cloth in white. Let me pull back so you guys can see all of the tinsel decor and the garlands. So definitely the fall is starting to dwindle down and we're starting to see more Halloween over here at Dollar Tree. I just showed these skulls already. They are ceramic. So in my last video, I told you guys I couldn't reach the jack-o'-lantern form of this sign, but it is here. Hello, pumpkin. The ghost is so cute. And then for some reason, these trees are, you know, all over the place. So I only got one to show you. I don't want to mess everything up. And then they're going to blame me. Okay, we pretty much covered everything else. We're in the hunt for new things. This is what I wanted to see. The Halloween signs nicely displayed. Look at everything over here. The windows are, you know, right there. So sorry if the lighting is a bit weird. Just creeping it real. Very fun. We found the majority of the signs in my last video. But if you remember, things were, you know, packed in that store. Because, you know, they had so much. And it wasn't, you know, easy to see everything as it is in this store. The Black Cat, Happy Halloween, which is Brew. Welcome Halloween. They did change the color of that crescent moon. Trick or treat. Welcome to our tomb. Happy haunting and to all scary good fright. Welcome to my frightfully creepy crypt. The apothecary shop signs I thought were amazing. This is a sign I was trying to see if you guys remember with the skull. So many great signs. The bat one is right there. Happy Halloween. Those are new this year. And we did cover them in my sneak peeks months before. The mystic parlor signs. And then these signs over here. The stacked pumpkins. How fun. And the skulls the size especially 
Those stacked pumpkins, don't they look like Johanna Parker vibes, right? And then the vertical sign, spooky beware. The potion one, very fun. They have some steaks. Which is brew served daily with the bat. Stop for a spell. The candy corn I showed you already. But these right here. These are such a great find. And guess what? For Christmas, they will be having some elves. 21 inches tall. So basically kind of like that size. Look at this wall decor. That's interesting. But yes, I will be showing the elf signs in this Christmas sneak peek that I will be including in this video. So I'm just going to be pointing out new things. Look at the papel picado, Dave the Dead Garland. Those are felt. Here's an overview of what this area has, which we did cover already. These hands are glow in the dark. This is all the Day of the Dead items. Those are the tote bags that I was talking about. I didn't know they had this design. That really pops. I did like this Day of the Dead towel here, right there in the corner on the left. Very pretty. These are some stencils, actually, to decorate your pumpkin. They have some decor kits. And they even have some Sugar Skull night lights. The socks we covered in my last video. Harvest Welcome Blessed. It has the wheelbarrow and the sunflowers. And then these vertical scarecrow signs I had not seen. Hello Fall. So here's the boy. They also have Happy Fall Y'all with his bow tie. And then they have some fall rugs. These are the $1.25 ones, so they are the thin ones. Hello fall with the barn, the blue truck, lots of different pumpkins. You see all those signs that were on top of them? Uh, I was trying to do my best. They have welcome with all of the pretty leaves. This one I was trying to get to. We've seen in the past though. Uh, this one I thought was nice with the turkeys and the gnomes. Gnome Sweet Gnome, perfect for Thanksgiving. And here's this one that I was saying. It says, gather here with the wreath. This is a very nice find. Hello, pumpkin. Wow. If you told me that one was from Dollar Tree, I wouldn't believe you because it looks like something you would find from TJ Maxx. That was a nice steak. The pumpkin had a plaid. Now look over here. They do have a box full of these plastic light-up candles. They do have skulls. They have the white, the orange, and the black. But personally, I think you can really tell the design in the black and the white one. The orange, you can kind of see it. I did show these lanterns in my last video. You guys really liked them. They have the ghost, the black cat, and the witch. Just showing them really quickly. They did get in some new, you know, faux potion books. So there's also this one. So these are kind of like the ones we've seen in the past where you can open them and put something inside. El Libro de los Muertos. I like that this one's actually in Spanish. And it looks like it has a little bookmark. The spine is also very nice. That's the inside. It's purple. There was also this one. Tales of Terror. How pretty are these, right? The charm is also very pretty with that gold leaf. These are glass, but they were coated kind of like in a frosted look. They felt like sandpaper. That's the best way I can describe them. The ones to the right we've seen over the years. They did get these in gold, which I haven't seen. Only the black ones before. Here's a closer look. Have you guys seen these mugs? I only found K. And it has the kangaroo she's putting on makeup. It was an odd find. It was the only one. And then look at these bowls that they are getting in. Black, black and white. Very farmhouse. And then look what I spotted down here. 
some red and black buffalo checkered bowls and plates. These weren't here because I'm always looking up and down. And then look, cookies for Santa. These are all ceramic, by the way. So they have this plate and they also have this plate here. And at the bottom, they do have the charger. I was trying to be careful because they were very heavy. Okay. In the Dollar Tree Plus, they did get in the tapered candles. I don't know if you guys remember these from my sneak peek portions of my videos weeks prior. $5 for two. And these I thought were also very nice for five. Comes all set up for you. And then these were actually, you know, pretty heavy. They have the crow. It does have glitter. Over on this shelf, everything is priced five. And then look at these boxes of stacked pumpkins. These are plastic, five dollars, 24 inches though. They have all orange or white, mustard and orange. I know it's early, but look at all of these Hot Wheels they got in. I was surprised because not always do they have Hot Wheels. I know because I have a son and he's always looking at their display. But these are awesome stocking stuffers. So get them if you see them now because these are going to start selling very quickly. They do have, uh, you know, Barbie. They also have the Buzz Lightyear editions. I see Surge. They also have Buzz up here. This store is also being turned into a Dollar Tree Plus. So I see them moving things, you know, cramming them into other aisles. For the people who are new, I welcome you to subscribe to my channel. So basically what I do is I like to do research ahead of time. I like to know what Dollar Tree will put out weeks, various weeks before and let my subscribers know. So they know what's going to hit Dollar Tree way ahead of the game. They know what to look out for, how many styles of each specific decor piece there will be, etc. Because if you know Dollar Tree, it's like a hunting game sometimes. They have things, you know, everywhere. So if you're new, I already shared all of these items. These are just some of the new things that I have shared. So I will link my Dollar Tree playlist. That way you can see all my previous recent shop with me's. And towards the end, I have, you know, all of the sneak peeks of the future seasons. I've been doing it for Halloween, Easter, you know, fall, etc. So you can see they're bringing in some gingerbread decor, some candy cane, and lots of good stuff. The retro Santa. Let's talk new. Okay, they're going to bring in these chargers in the classic red, white, and green Christmas plaid. It is beautiful. They're also going to have two choices of this sign and the snowman. We have seen them with the blue background recently. So they're bringing them also in this white or red. For the people that like the snowman and Santa. They're also bringing in some gnome signs. Welcome. These are some tabletop signs. They will be $1.25 and look at Santa. He is so cute. Oh my goodness. These next items are going to be a hot find. Don't these remind you of Walmart with their mini ornaments? Look at these sets. So they have this one. It comes with a total of six with three designs, two of each. They also have the red truck, the sleigh, jingle all the way. And for my gingerbread lovers, look at these. They look like baking sheets, so they have no L. Joy has the girl gingerbread, and they have peace. These are so cute also. Have yourself a merry and magical Christmas. They have this new sign. I love that they're still being inclusive. Merry, happy, jolly. These are some new signs from the ones we've seen, you know, the previous years. There will also be this style. It says ho ho ho. It has a snowman, the elves, Santa pulling the sleigh with presents. And then oh holy night. This one's really really precious. It has 
Mary and Joseph with baby Jesus. They will be a dollar twenty-five. These are the signs I was talking about. They're gonna be, I think, twenty-one point five inches tall. So they have the elves, they have the Nutcracker and Santa. Dollar Tree knows that gingerbread is popular right now, and I am loving it. Look at these candle holders. They have the gingerbread house. Love the peppermint. Love the classic colors. They also have Santa. You can see it says Noel there, you know, on his beard. They also have the gnome. He's holding a candy cane. All of these are, you know, very cute in design, I must say. The fourth one will be the truck, of course, with the Christmas tree. Merry Christmas. I hope these will look nice in person because, you know, sometimes they look cute here on pictures, but then in person they don't and vice versa. Dollar Tree always brings out some containers. These are plastic, but they're adding a new design. Have a cozy, comfy Christmas with the hot chocolate. I thought you guys would like these. There's still more. Look at these fabric placemats. They have the red, white, and green plaid. Very pretty. It says Joy. There will be four styles in total. They have all plaid, home for the holidays, the most wonderful time of the year, and the Joy one. If you are a friend of the channel, we did see the doormats that do match these placemats. So if you saw my last video, you know what I'm talking about. They go together. Gnome for the holidays, they're bringing in a new design for the oven mitts. They have the gnome, one is holding a hot chocolate. Here's another design, it says Merry Everything, it has three gnomes. Of course, they will have the pot holders for each of the designs. They're probably going to have also some towels. Look at these bath rugs, yes, bath rugs. I think they're supposed to be the comfy kind, I don't know how good they will be. These will be in the Dollar Tree Plus stores. They have three designs. They have the gnomes with candy canes, trees. The second one in the middle has lots of different, you know, popular words and phrases. And the third one is red with white snowflakes. Family Dollar usually puts out some very cute embroidered washcloths. Well, now Dollar Tree Plus will have some. So you get a set of five for just $3. Again, these are embroidered. So look at these, you get two solids, you get one with the car, the candy canes, and fa la la. This set, you get two solids, white or blue, let it snow, the snowflake, and the snowman. These are perfect for after Christmas, you know, during winter. One white, one red, one with the Christmas tree, one with the ornaments, and one with the poinsettia. Very classic and beautiful. And the fourth one, two white solids, that one has the mistletoe, some trees, and the Christmas tree. Dollar Tree Plus will also be getting these reindeers and snowflakes. They have different heights. You can add, you know, some greenery at the bottom if you want to, you know, make it a little bit more special. They're going to get some new garlands. These are felt. They have the lights or this one here for $3. They did not include a picture with them, you know, extended. So... That's what I see, therefore that's what I share. I hope you guys enjoy this shop with me. It takes a little bit of time, you know, to edit everything, but I know you guys enjoy these. Please like it if you did, subscribe if you are new. Again, watch those previous videos so you can be up to date. Don't forget the notification bell. I'll see you guys in another video, a virtual hug. Goodbye.